Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You can edit relationship links between tasks in a project file to enter lag time or lead time between tasks. For example, you could allow a day of lag time to pass between tasks. Alternatively, you could also allow for lead time, where you begin working on a second task before completing all the work on a first task. You can edit the duration shown in the predecessor's column within the Gantt chart view of your project file to enter lead time or lag time for a task. To add lead time, enter the precedent task reference followed by the abbreviation for the type of link that they share. Then enter the value as a negative value to the precedent task reference. For example, assume that you have linked tasks 2 and 3 in a project file with a finish to start task relationship. In the predecessor's column for task 3, you could enter 2FS minus 2D, which would give you a two-day lead time on the task. You can either enter a specific value or enter the value as a percentage of the task. For example, entering 2FS minus 50% for task 3 would give you a 50% lead time based on the duration of task 2. To enter lag time, enter the precedent task reference followed by the abbreviation for the type of link that they share. Then enter the value as a positive value. For example, assume that you've linked tasks 2 and 3 in a project file with a finish to start task relationship. If you enter the value of 2FS plus 1D into the predecessor's column for task 3, you add one day of lag time to the completion of task 2 before starting task 3. As with lead time, lag time can be entered as either a positive amount or a percentage. Alternatively, you can enter the lag time and lead time within the Task Information dialog box on the Predecessors tab in the Lag column. In this case, you enter the amount to increase or decrease into the field. Entering a positive value adds lag time, and entering a negative value adds lead time. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.